Hey, good morning, guys. What's going on? Welcome back to Riding Along with Dan. It is Wednesday morning, 6.56 in the morning, and it is 55 degrees outside. It's not such a bad morning at all. Today's the first day I'm wearing my short pants, so I got my shorts on. So, uh, you guys had asked me to take a picture of 66.25, but uh, it's no longer at the yard. I'm sorry to say it was brought back to the Patterson yard where it belongs. Uh, now we have another Peterbilt in the yard, 66.33. So, if I get a chance and I see it back there today, I will take a picture of 66.33. Uh, that's another new one to me. I've never seen that one before. I think that truck is actually out of Sloatsburg, New York. I'm not sure. But it's pretty similar to uh, 6631. It's a real nice looking Peterbilt. Runs good. You know, I mean, it's a nice truck. It's a good truck. And uh, TJ's, uh, who's using that today? I think Mayran is using that today. So let me get started on my after seven. It is 657. Uh, let me just dump out the first can. Hopefully nobody complains. This morning, because uh, I started early, I have a doctor's appointment today. But uh, while I was waiting before I turned you guys on, uh, I did put a coat of wax uh, on the cab, on the doors, on the corner of the cab. Put a coat of wax. Later on today, when I get a chance, I'm going to do the front of the truck. Uh, I like doing it because uh, it helps to uh, actually protect the paint and it stops all this nasty crap from sticking to the front of the truck. So uh, obviously, yes, I use Meguiar's for everything. It's uh, Meguiar spray wax and for me it works really well. I use a lot of Meguiar's products to uh, clean the truck. Wires actually had this, it comes in a yellow can. I don't know if I showed you already, but it's a tire shine. And let me tell you, man, I love it. Spray it on and that's it, you're good to go. Let me run this up.
what do you guys think in your opinion? My subscribers that actually drive in the sanitation industry and those of you who like to watch different style trucks. In everybody's opinion, do you think the Mack truck is better than the Peterbilt truck? in the sanitation industry? Do you think the Mac is better? Or do you think the Peterbilt is better? Now the Mac, the Mac they use in uh, roll off, garbage truck, uh, front loader, all different applications, okay? They even use the Mac for the side loader. Uh, a lot of different ways they incorporate the Mac into the sanitation industry. Also with the Peterbilt, you see a Peterbilt front loader, obviously. Uh, Peterbilt garbage truck, Peterbilt, uh, Peterbilt roll-off, but uh, Peterbilt side loader. Uh, you know, there's, there's a lot of different applications. You see the Peterbilt front loader with the uh, Corrado can in the front on the forks. That's uh, another application. You also see a Mac using the Corrado can. But in your opinion, what do you guys think is the better of the two, the Mac? Well, then again, we could have three or four, right? We could have the auto car. We could have the crane carrier, the Mac, and the Peterbilt. So you got four trucks right there that are commonly used in the uh, sanitation industry. And so, in your opinion, which one do you guys think is the best? Again, uh, we picked four. The auto car, crane carrier, Peterbilt, and the Mac. In my opinion, me personally, I like the Mac and the Peterbilt. Reason being, I already drove them as a front loader and as a garbage truck. So I picked Peterbilt and Mac. I've never driven an auto car in the sanitation industry and I've never driven a crane carrier. So I can't answer for those two. But that, that's my opinion because I've driven both of those trucks. Uh, you know, everybody's different. So I'd like to hear what you guys have to say. Which truck do you guys think is better? Also, I wanted to ask you guys uh, if anybody's interested in uh, riding along with Dan Decal uh, for free. Just go to my email, give me your name and your address. Uh, also, if anybody's interested in uh, riding along with Dan T-shirt. Uh, just hit me on my Gmail. You'll find it on my YouTube channel. That's 33 Shamrocks at gmail.com. Oh my god, these freaking ropes, they suck. Again, my Gmail is 33 Shamrocks at gmail.com. You'll find it on the front page of my YouTube channel. If anybody's interested in a riding along with Dan Decal for free, if anybody's interested in a riding along with Dan t-shirt, just reach out to me, let me know. All I need is your name and your address, and I will let you know uh, what sizes we have in the t-shirts and how much they are. So let me know if you guys are interested. Okay, I forgot to remind you guys yesterday that uh, I have the t-shirts, so I just wanted to give a shout out. I let you guys know they are ready, they're available for sale. So just let me know, okay? So when I got back yesterday, I cleaned out the truck as I needed to do it. Uh, obviously I didn't do it Monday because nobody used the truck the week before, so it was clean. 
So I went in 